Riding a wave of popularity after leading the successful effort to make medical marijuana legal in Florida, Attorney John Morgan is now responding to a petition drive that is urging voters to support him for a run for governor. Thursday morning, he tweeted his appreciation, then listed the things he believes. He thinks marijuana should be decriminalized. Inmates serving time for drug convictions should be released. The minimum wage should be raised to $15 an hour, and he thinks a governor should serve just one term. In a later tweet, he wrote, we might do this. Give me some time. And these actually are the types of issues that excite voters. New state lawmaker Carlos Smith tells me Morgan's beliefs will excite voters. The way that we do that is by running progressives who have bold ideas that get people excited to get into the political fold. He seems to be the definition of a literal limousine liberal. West 2 News Republican political expert Eddie Fernandez says Morgan's fundraising expertise and success with Amendment 2 would make him a formidable candidate. Getting into the governor's race isn't a big leap. His name ID, he's a known commodity. Uh, now he's running for governor. He, he is certainly somebody to, to be reckoned with if he is serious about this. According to the organizers of the website, ForTheGovernor.com, more than 2,500 people have signed the petition in the first four days, and another 1,000 people have responded through social media. Angela? All right, Greg.